our new segment, Faith, Hope, and Love, and we're out here in Cleveland. We're here with Rabbi Robert Nosenchuk. Thank you so much for joining us this afternoon. My pleasure to be here. We're talking about GCC, which is um, an interfaith coalition. Talk to us about that. Well, uh, Antje Chesed Fairmont Temple was one of the founding partners of uh, Greater Cleveland Congregations. This is a coalition of 40 plus synagogues, churches, mosques, and other allied organizations, all working together across interfaith lines, across racial and geographic disparities to promote a more just and equitable and fair Cleveland so that people in, in some of Cleveland's most troubled neighborhoods would get opportunities uh, for jobs where the children could go safely to schools that really nourish their education, uh, where Medicare expansion and health care access are, are continually lifted up uh, in terms of uh, their value and importance. Uh, in, a, in a fairly segregated community like Cleveland, it deeply moves me to see people uh, standing together in coalition across those racial and geographic and cultural and religious lines, really expressing that inner yearning of uh, Christianity, Islam, Judaism, to stand together to build a world that is repaired. Uh, we, are, uh, we stand in lockstep with one another and are willing to stick out our necks uh, over issues that are not, uh, not, not always popular. Uh, but that, uh, but that when we can build consensus, when thousands of local people of faith and their allies can make a difference around uh, getting people a a the education they deserve, getting their neighborhoods uh, the safe and fair policing that they deserve, uh, when we can make a difference around criminal justice reform and the over incarceration rate, these are tangible, uh, tangible efforts. And I think there's a there's a strong yearning right now for people to know what what ways can I spend my time my investment of uh, energy to really make a difference in a pretty uh, divided world. And uh, I'm thrilled to say that GCC is, uh, is one of those, uh, those entities that's made such a difference over the last uh, six or seven years here in Cleveland. That's wonderful. Can you tell us a little bit about your Jewish religion, your faith, um, your beautiful traditions? Sure. Well, so uh, the uh, Jewish community over the coming weeks is preparing uh, to go through the month of Elul, which is the, um, the month of introspection and reflection leading to the beginning of the Jewish year, Rosh Hashanah, the observance of the Jewish New Year, uh, uh, is, the, is the beginning point of a, uh, of a year ref reflecting and repenting for past transgressions, uh, for how can we improve our efforts to uh, repair the world and repair our own hearts over the coming year. Uh, it's one of the traditions of Judaism during this month of Elul is on purpose to get near uh, those whom, with whom you might have some bad feelings, to improve the possibility that someone might be willing to step forward and take the steps towards repentance, towards reconciliation, so that you can begin the the new year with a sense of purity and hope and aspiration for a better outcome. Uh, it's, a, it's, a, it's a very uh, critical part of the year for the Jewish community, uh, but it leads off an array of strong interests that our vibrant Cleveland Jewish community care about year-round. Our unequaled support for the State of Israel and uh, for efforts to strengthen Zionism here and all across the world. Um, the, the deep and abiding Jewish cultural traditions uh, that, don't, that don't just include holidays but also life cycle observances from the time we're born uh, throughout our lives. Uh, it's uh, the summer still and so uh, uh, there are so many weddings that I'm participating in at this season in Cleveland. Mm -hmm. uh, the limited time where we have this much delicious sunlight yeah. under which to uh, enjoy Jewish wedding traditions are becoming more universal people are uh, utilizing their Jewish weddings to help teach their friends, neighbors, and loved ones more about uh, what Ju Ju Judaism and what, about what Jewish uh, views around holiness mean to them. 